Yeah, and Underwater Adventures here at the Mall of America has a brand new name and has a whole new things, a whole lot more to look at here. Just like this uh, Stingray exhibit, brand new here at the Mall of America. We're talking about the brand new exhibit out here at the mall coming up a little bit later on Sunrise. Well, the aquarium at Mall of America is going to new depths to bring you new and improved experiences. Underwater Adventures has a new look, a new name, and now new creatures for you to check out as well. Dave Berggren, live in Bloomington at Mall of America with more on the aquarium's new design. Hey, yeah, last hour we were almost behind the scenes to kind of behind the scenes of uh, the aquarium to kind of see where, you know, fish were fed and the exhibits taken care of. Now we're outside where kind of the, the public can walk through. And again, Underwater Adventure Worlds, no more. It's now called Sea Life Minnesota. In fact, this is uh, one of the Stingray exhibits, a brand new Stingray exhibit. We'll talk more about that in just a moment. But uh, again, so many more things to see. They're actually doubling from 5,000 creatures to 10,000 creatures. Sharks will still, of course, be the focal point as they transition from Shark Cove to Atlantis Temple. But really, the aquarium promises not to disappoint. Sea Life Minnesota officially opens to the public tomorrow. So again, we are uh, we are out here at uh, some of the new parts of Sea Life Minnesota, and this is uh, this is Craig. Craig's one of the general managers here. And Craig, real quick, how excited are you guys to kind of just relaunch this thing, redesigned uh, aquarium here at the Mall of America? Uh, we're we're really excited. It's been a couple years in the making. Um, we've been working on these things um, for quite some time, obviously, um, from around the world, and it's uh, it's really going to be an amazing experience for visitors. So yeah, really a lot more to see too. I mean, cr new creatures that are that are coming in really for the first time ever, right? Yep, we've got uh, a new rock pool or touch pool experience here behind us. Uh, a new Ray Lagoon exhibit, which is going to be really sharp. There's a little crawl behind tunnel yeah, for I kids with a couple bubble windows. You can go up on the uh, platform up above and look down in the glass floor. Um, garden eels, octopus, lots of neat stuff coming. Yeah, really fun for the whole family too. I mean, we were over at looking at the stingray soon. You can really get interactive and up close and up close and personal with the stingrays. Yeah. So perfect for the kids. This is one of the new touch pools here at uh, Sea Life Minnesota, and kids can actually come up here and and and, and touch real you know, aquatic life. Yep. Um, so what exactly is in here that kids could really interact with and then learn about too? Lots of cool stuff. Uh, lots of sea stars, um, some big snails. We've got some horse cocks. Horseshoe crabs is always a favorite. Um, we've got some shrimp that'll crawl on your hand and clean off some dead skin. Kind of fun. <laughs> Tickles cool. ever, gives everyone a little bit of a tickle. Um, some sea urchins. Just, yeah, lots of neat neat critters. All right, well, let me tell you some more information about Sea Life Minnesota. The, the uh, exhibit actually opens officially tomorrow. Underwater Adventures becomes Sea Life Minnesota. It officially opens to the public tomorrow, and we're going to have uh, more on care11.com, but a lot of interactive kids things as well, for perfect for the family. So we're going to actually introduce some of these new creatures to the touch pool, really for the first time ever. What am I touching here? Uh, that is a horseshoe crab. This is a horseshoe <laughs> crab, and this is the first time he is entering this exhibit. Kim and Tim, I'm tossing it back to you guys, but that's going to be one of the kid favorites, and you can actually get up close and personal here at Sea Life Minnesota. Guys? All right, Dave Bergen at the Mall of America. David, thank you so much. All right, you bet.